What's up guys? So I got my intake manifold here. Y'all saw in uh, older videos that I had it primered and now I'm going to use this black wrinkle plus paint VHT to uh, get that nice black wrinkle finish. I'm just going to shake the can pretty good. Hit it with some coats. So the instruction says to wait about five minutes in between each coat and to spray it in a cross hatch pattern. So like start vertically, hit it vertically and then uh, horizontally and then it says in like a diagonal pattern. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to do it side by side because I don't have like somewhere to hang this. So I'm just going to do this side and then let it dry good and then I'll hit the other side. Uh, as much as I can but it covered a lot uh, on this side so far and it's looking pretty clean so far so we'll see how it comes out so now I'm gonna do the the vertical a little bit later in the day I went and came back and this is the other side I flipped it over so I could uh, knock it out and get the salt sprayed up it was looking really good it's starting to bubble up already but um, I'm actually gonna take this inside to dry because it's looking like it's gonna rain well damn it looks probably like a sunny day to you guys but yeah I'm in Florida so I know this is about to turn nasty any second but yeah it's already starting to wrinkle and bubble up so i'll put this away and uh, go run some errands and i'll be back and see if the weather is good enough to knock out the rest of it so guys this is the next day and this is the finished results i really like how it came out and man it looks really good it has this really defined like wrinkly texture and i think it's gonna look really good in the car I think the most important thing when painting things is to really worry about the prep work. I spend a lot of time, uh, you know, just cleaning this and sanding it, getting all the oil and everything off and then primering it so uh, it has a good surface to stick on and it came out really well. I think another thing is I'm usually very impatient and for example, in other things that I painted, I just want to get the coats done, but this time I really just followed the time and the instructions where it said to wait the given amount of time before doing the next coats, and I think it really paid off. Just a little bit of patience ended up giving me a, a better result. But yeah, it came out really nice. I really like that finish, and um, even though this is that wrinkle coat, so I think it's it's very forgiving so as you guys can see you know well I wasn't you know painting it like super super carefully I was just trying to get in there and and spray like as much areas as I could but uh, even then it came out uh, really nice so if you guys like how this came out and uh, you want to know what I use, I'll have a link in the description so you guys can get it. I know it's available at at your local auto parts store, maybe like Walmart. But, you know, just in case you want it, I'll have it in there for you guys. So if you guys want to see more videos, more um, how-tos, and my build, currently I got the 
all-wheel drive five-speed CRV that's going on boost so be sure to check that out and if you enjoy these videos please share like and subscribe thank you